It's been too long. Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Thorn Degree 14 here. Welcome back to another reaction video. I am finally back after my week-long vacation and when I visited Florida to see my dad. I am finally back to get more videos done. And what good timing to start off with none other than the Nintendo Direct reaction. Don't worry, I will be reacting to the SMG4 episode that came out last week. But I, I thought we'd do this one first because honestly, this one I'm really been excited for today. And then I'll get to reacting to the other SMG4 video because that actually has something supposedly surprising, I been told. So I can't wait to see that either. Anyways, without further ado, let's watch the Nintendo Direct uh, to, sorry, June 21st, Nintendo Direct full presentation. I don't know what games to expect. I'm hoping for Mario Odyssey 2. Mario Odyssey 2? Sorry, I should use the other hand. Um, I don't know what other games could come out. I'm just hoping for another uh, basic Mario game, honestly. So far, they haven't talked more about it. I hope we do get to know more about Pikmin 4, because I will be talking about that for a bit, maybe. Or, heck, maybe I'll discuss it a little later. And that being said, let's get, finally get on with the reaction in 3, 2, 1. Oh, I can't wait for this. I've waited all day since work for this, so let's get on. What do you got? Oh, I should, uh, let me turn off the captions. Oh, Pokemon! What's Pokemon Scarlet and Violet have? Okay. Right, yeah, I've seen all this before. Right, I've played through the main story already, so... What are you gonna add? What DLC are we getting? I'd love to know. Okay, what... So, just a handhold? What, what is it? Scarlet and Violet? The hidden treasure of Area Zero. Ex oh, that's a cool mountain. The Squavit, Sentret, Hoot Hoot, Glider. Hey, these are these are Pokemon aren't normal to the game. Part one, the Teal Mask. Okay, so we got new Pokemon already. We got Volpix, Oracorio, Apom. Oh wait, I can get Ambipom. Yes. Oh, hey, Carmine and Kieran. Hey, you two seem like a nice group. Kitakami, the first experience, okay. So, yeah, we got Yanma, Wooper, first day of the Festival of Mask. Oh, are we getting to, like, some traditional stuff? <gasps> oh, wait, wait, I saw that! Was that a Hisuian, like, Growlithe back there? Like a statue of one? Are we- is this a tie-in to Legends of Arceus? <laughs> oh, who are these guys? You don't look like- Who are you? Oh. So you're the teal mask, eh? Alright, that looks good! Oh, what's this? A stadium area? Blueberry Academy. The Indigo Disc. What? Yeah, so we're seeing a lot of Johto Pokemon. Lacey. Okay, there's Unova Minchino. So is this like a battle tournament sort of thing? Oh, a terrarium underneath the sea. Oh, that's so cool! So many different Pokemon! Oh, is this like a playground area? Where you can catch different Pokemon species? Because that sounds nice. Oh, Flygon, Al Creamy. Oh, yeah, this is looking nice. I'm already interested in this. <laughs> That's without a frying pan. Okay. Oh, oh. And who is this? Oh, you like a turtle with like? Oh, you're you're like a little. Oh my gosh, that's so cool! I like it. 
I like Hello, it. Hello, everyone. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and yeah? I'll be one of your guides for today's Nintendo Direct. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> and I'll also be joining today. Didn't realize it got a little messed up. Hopefully, we still have the recording in place. Anyways, back to it. Nintendo Direct. Right. A special event will be held in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. Oh. We hope you'll participate in it. I certainly will. Okay. Let's see our first batch of headlines. I'd like to see it. I'm trying to get rid of the HUD stuff. I'm not touching them. Oh, Sonic! It's a supersonic squad of superstars. A squad of superstars? What? Sonic and friends are spin dashing into a brand new 2D side scrolling game, Sonic Superstars. Oh, that looks well, good. Oh, they got Amy, to too. Speed through beautiful worlds <laughs> as Sonic. This looks like a revamp of the Take original. The That's cool. Oh, who's that? Walls and glide as Knuckles. Or swing Who is that in the background? As Amy Rose. Ah, nice. Everybody gets unique abilities, as By before. The incredible power of the Chaos Emeralds, yeah. You can summon a storm of clones. <laughs> what? Uncover hidden secrets. Oh. And so much more. Oh, he's got Wisp power. And for the <laughs> first time in the series, yeah. local co-op is available for up to four players. Oh my gosh, we got co-op! Do we also have difficulty settings? Because that would be nice for a Sonic game. Combine your powers oh, oh, and take oh, on the evil oh. Dr. Eggman. When uh, Sonic classic Superstars on. launches on the Nintendo Switch system this fall. Dang, this fall? So these are, are all these going to come out recently? A cozy life is just around the corner. <laughs> a life sim? Welcome to Palea. In this free to play adventure sim, create the idyllic life of your dreams alongside in-game characters mm. and players from all over the world. I see. Build houses, decorate your home plot, grow crops in your garden, mm. and more. Play with other residents in online co-op or carve out your blissful life solo. <laughs> and if you're eager to explore, there's plenty of life beyond the village. Ooh. Set off on a vast journey to uncover Palea's many mysteries. Oh. Or just kick back and relax at home. How you live is entirely up to you. Oh my gosh. What this... kind of coziness will you choose? But this is not too bad, actually. Free to play and launches on Nintendo Switch this holiday. All right. Sounds pretty good, but I think I have plenty of life sims. Ignite your oh. heart. Oh my gosh, it's Persona, and they're all chibi styled. The Phantom Thieves return in this tactical <laughs> spin off of Persona 5. Nice. When the group ends up in an unfamiliar world, they must join forces yep. with a revolutionary named Arena to mm. combat the armies that have taken control. Oh, I see. During battle, assess the situation and determine whether to unleash an attack up. A nice hit, Skull. Nice job, Morgana. Or using a Persona. Yep, the classic persona. I don't remember his name. He's down to perform another action called One More. Then surround your foes and take them out with dramatic flair <laughs> using the new all out attack, Triple Threat. Oh, so it can require three people, not everybody, I'm guessing? The fusion ability from the Persona series returns, allowing mm. you to combine personas to form other ones. Now, does this one force you to take the initial one down, though? In this strange world. Like it did in Persona 5? A revolutionary tale will ignite when Persona 5 Tactica launches on Nintendo Switch. That actually that looks fun! I, I'll admit I'm not a big Persona player, but... Today. I like Please the style of that one. Retailers. All right, what's next? Step into a Saturday morning cartoon. Oh. Calling all Myth heroes Force. for the first person roguelike hmm. adventure. Myth Force. Enter a high fantasy world inspired by Saturday morning cartoons of the past. Okay. It's up to you to stop the evil Daedalus from taking over, hmm. but it won't be easy. Treacherous yeah, tombs and might... cryptic castles threaten your survival. So there's a first-person mode? That's actually kind of cool. Magic to smite hordes of monsters. Okay, okay. In each run, you can find treasure to help boost your character's right. abilities. And collected Weapons money, and more. buy trinkets. This Plus, reminds me a lot of the style of... Can share the adventure what game was it? I can't remember. Darn it. Drop in and out at any time oh, a Dungeon Defenders. Right. Ahead by the power of teamwork. <laughs> Myth Force launches on the Nintendo Switch system this year. Right, nice looking, but I think I'll pass on that one. This oh, something Splatoon related. Pretty 
sweet. I know I haven't played Splatoon in a while. I should totally play some more Splatfest videos. What do you got? Pick it up. It's going down. Reap in the Splatlands with Teacut. And I think that guy's for life! Uh, here we go. What's the theme? What's the theme? Shiver, you gotta know. It's that time. <laughs> the next Splatfest for the Splatoon 3 game has been confirmed. What is it? What? Okay, squids. Here's the theme. Drum roll. Which flavor of oh! The is best? Min chip. Vanilla, I'm with min chip all the way. Min chip. This Splatfest will be held <laughs> during the dates shown on screen. All right, I will be there. I will absolutely be there. Mm, I'll need to make some more Splatoon videos. It's been a while since I've played. Add your favorite flavor to victory. <laughs> Plus, get splatting in themed battles with challenges. Foggy more knows. Splatastic events are on the way. Be on the lookout for more info in the future. All right. Hey, that was pretty good. Oh, more Pokemon. Oh, what's this? Hello, Inteleon. Hello, Raboot. To promote an even stronger bond between the people and Pokemon of Rhyme City. Yeah. I hereby proclaim this day the start of Pokemon friendship. Oh my gosh, it's a Detective Pikachu sequel? Pikachu. <laughs> you are the ideal detective duo. So we're actually getting a sequel to this game. Part of detective work. Quit <laughs> and investigate. I still can't get over that voice yeah, for that so Pikachu. For my coffee. Something tells me this is just the beginning. <laughs> a light roast Does this time. mean we get a movie sequel now? Now that we have a sequel to the game? I hope so. <laughs> oh, Mimikyu! Oh, more Pico, Ludicolo, Slowpoke. There is something the two of you must know. Mewtwo. Oh, Mewtwo. Based on our deductions, the culprit is clear, isn't it? Uh, a bolt of brilliance. <laughs> Magic Arps. Pikachu. And I'm what you might call a great detective. Uh, yep, returns October 6th. I sure 6th. wish somebody would bring me some coffee. We'll go to Pokemon Cafe for Pikachu it, buddy. Returns. <laughs> Looks like he still loves coffee. Hey, that's what funny. What will Tim and this tough-talking Pikachu solve together? More info I still can't get over that this was the game. But honestly, the idea is kind of cool. Next, please take a look at this. <laughs> oh, what's next? Oh. Mario RPG! Oh, wait. What, what are you doing? You're remastering it? What are you doing? Oh, you're remastering it! Yes! <laughs> oh my gosh, I've always wanted to play it, and I've heard so much about it, now I get a chance to replay it. <laughs> Mario's so tiny! Mario RPG! Oh my gosh, it looks so good! <laughs> oh, I gotta give this a try. I have got to give this a try. Oh, there's, I think his name's Mallow. There's Dino, the man, Bowser, and Peach. In a Donkey Kong in, in a chain. Oh, I'm guessing this stuff's new. Maybe. Oh, who's this guy? Yep. Piranha Planet, or Piranha Plant, sorry. Oh, I know that character, actually. I know some of these, but... Uh, uh... All right. I got our new Let's Play plan. <laughs> when does it come out? Just tell me when it comes out. Because already I'm loving this style. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this looks so good! I love it! <laughs> I love how short Mario is, too! <laughs> November 17th, you got it! Oh, and pre-orders begin today, good to know!
Originally released on Super NES, right. Super Mario RPG returns with brand new graphics. Mm -hmm. Whether you played the original game or not, why not take the Oh my gosh, I know so many people are gonna flip their lid at this. I'm already really excited. Mr. Koizumi, that last trailer featured Mario, right? not the only one getting a game. Huh? What do you mean? Hmm? Let's take a peek. Oh, uh, who is it? Huh? Oh, oh, hey! Are we getting a Super Princess Peach game? That's right. Princess Peach will star as the main character in a brand new game. When she steps on this particular oh my spot gosh. on stage. Huh? What the? Whoa. What on earth is happening? I can't get over your nonchalant reactions, just like, oh. More details at a later date. I gotta know more, though! That actually looks really awesome! What? <gasps> Wait. Oh, is that Dark Moon? Are we getting Dark Moon for Switch? Yes! Dark Moon, originally released on Nintendo 3DS. Oh, I love Dark Moon! We hope you look forward to seeing more of Luigi's ghostly antics. True. Are you gonna add something new to it, I'm guessing? Oh. Both games will launch next year. Oh, I don't want to wait next Mario, year though. Princess Peach and Luigi. Looks like Mario fans have a lot of games to look forward to. Yes! More details will be shared in the future. All right. All right. Let's see some more headlines. All right. Now I know what they mean by said this was a great direct. Oh, Gotham City's ultimate protector. Oh, which Arkham game is this? Or is it a new one? To oh, this is Arkham City. You to know the oh, wait, that's Asylum. Or Knight, actually. Oh, same voice actor! You still know how to make an entrance. Indeed. To is this the whole collection? Welcome Asylum. Arkham City forces beyond your comprehension. And Arkham Knight. This place is dangerous. All right. Nice. Like it. Yeah, I love the Batman games. All of them. Gotham would be ours. Over my dead body. I believe that was the idea. <laughs> oh, knockout. <laughs> Oh. All right, I'm game on this one. Absolute game on this one. Don't be a stranger. You're always welcome here. Oh, <laughs> yeah, just knocks the guy out. Batman: Arkham Trilogy launches on Nintendo Switch this fall. Man, just nothing but good lineup so far. Play your cards right, mercenary. Okay. So what's this one? I've never seen this before. Mercenaries through cursed dungeons in the lands of Gloomhaven. Your Gloomhaven. tactical prowess yeah. is all that stands between ah. riches and certain death. This adaptation of the hit board game features turn-based yeah. card battles with RPG elements. Mm. Unleash deadly combos and bring doom upon your foes. But beware, this, this doesn't look too bad. is mm. close at hand. Choose from 17 different mercenaries, huh. brave over 260 grueling missions, okay. and master over 1,000 abilities. Cheers. your deck, set up synergies, and gain every advantage to survive. <laughs> Grit your teeth and earn your keep when Gloom Oh, September 18th. The so that's Switch actually system. sooner than others. September 18th. Pre-orders for the mercenaries and gold editions begin today on Nintendo eShop. All right, all right, solid. Come on, any more Mario stuff? Party going. All right, so Just Dance is getting stuff. All right, oh, I actually might need to turn this off in case of copyright. Yeah, there's probably going to be a lot of copyright in this anyway, so... All right, the graphics certainly are appealing. I think I could actually maybe get down with this one. I've tried a couple of them, but... Most of the time, dance games aren't my jam. I like RPGs and uh, like survival games, so... Alright, good music so far, good animation. 
Can the Joy-Con handle, like, the specific movements, though? Or is it just like the Wii Remote, where just any shake will do? I don't know, it's more fun to try and actually replicate the dance, even if you can't. I mean, I could get why it would be harder, too, so... Oh, a free month trial? Interesting. And it's available October 24th. Alright. A silent hope lies in a world without words. Seven wordless warriors. One day, a once peaceful realm was silenced by its king. Now, Whoa. seven wordless warriors will rise. In this action so. RPG, these heroes bound by fate must work together to explore the abyss and okay. find the secluded king. However, so they can't with its talk? Ever changing dungeons and powerful foes, conquering the abyss will be no easy feat. Hmm. Wield weapons like swords, bows, <laughs> magic, and more to survive this deadly okay. chasm. So they're like After you story today, ailments? Materials you've collected will help you cultivate resources and forge new items. Hmm. Repeated forays into the abyss will enable you to grow stronger and dive deeper. Okay. Can you hear me? Your yeah. guide on this journey is the kingdom's sorrowful princess, encased in a crystal of her own tears. And Aww. through a mysterious power, there's a big tear she trapped herself in, the in there. Of the silent warriors. Why did the king steal the world's words? And what awaits <laughs> the warriors in the depths of the abyss? So, do we get Silent to hear them? Hope dives onto Nintendo Switch, October 3rd. Hmm. Sparks will fly in these Oh, I have a feeling I know what this is. Cast spells and, and you lost me. In Fae Farm. Come on. I thought it was going to be a new something about the Sparks of Hope trailers. And off mischievous foes. Oh, man. Enrich your farm to help your character. I mean, this flourish. doesn't look too bad. I was just expecting something Decorate else. Sorry. Your to improve your this game is for the fine. Day ahead. But <laughs> and enchant your friends locally or online in four-player co-op. All right. Fay Farm launches as a console exclusive on Nintendo Switch. I remember September we got a lot of farming games when Pikmin 4 was announced. Bonus are available <laughs> now on Nintendo e Shop. Right, that's a pretty funny birdhouse. Zoom thing. into wild racing action with <laughs> Hot Wheels. Hot Wheels. Two turbo charge. Cool. Choose from over 130 vehicles and pull off outrageous stunts to avoid obstacles, <laughs> find shortcuts, and knock your rivals. Yeah, if only Hot the Wheels way. could actually do Unleash these. Your creativity Who knows? Maybe in the distant future they could. Building your own tracks. Oh, you could build your own tracks. Nice, nice. Plus, up to 12 players can hit the track online. Grab oh, I could imagine the ridiculous tracks people come up with. Nintendo Switch system, October 19. <laughs> Get your chassis looking classy in Manic Mechanics. Oh! It looks Grab like overcooked, but with machines. <laughs> and toss it over. Repair okay, that actually sounds like fun. In solo play I loved overcooked, so maybe I'll like this. But watch out for treacherous pits, oh. pesky UFOs, what? and other Why you hazards. Manic Mechanics. Just imagine, you're trying to repair Nintendo a car, Switch and then suddenly you get abducted by an alien. Today on Nintendo eShop. You're gonna repair some. Oh, here we are! For Mario plus Rabbids, Sparks of Hope. <laughs> oh, who are Mario you? And friends journey to a musical planet. That rabbit was cool looking. Filled with new areas to explore and new enemies to. Oh, he looks dangerous. What else will they find in this world of melodies? <laughs> oh, the King Baba Mecca! DLC. Holy Last crap! That's Hunter, that's Mario awesome! Later today. Wait, 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 wait. A demo of the main game is available now on Nintendo. Wait, did it say later today? Is that what it said? I gotta hear that again. The Last Spark Hunter launches later today. <gasps> oh my gosh, it does! The main game is available now on Nintendo eShop. I, all right, I'm gonna be changing up our let's play and stuff, and maybe I'll start doing that. You really think you stand a chance against us? Just, I, I know we're on the same thing, but I can't believe it. That was so much cool stuff. Oh, yes, the last spark. I gotta go make sure that's downloaded. I did buy the all the DLC stuff, but okay, what's this though? You are now cursed, unable to harm monsters. You were saying. 
You're going to have to become a monster wrangler. <laughs> so we have to train monsters to fight other monsters. <laughs> oh, so you can fuse them together to make stronger monsters. Oh, that was... See, a lot of these guys look really cool. Oh, that one in the snail shell was pretty adorable. It's a fat dragon. And speaking of which, Dragon Quest monsters. Uh, oh. The so called hero is here. Mm. Right, the guy who comes in all manner of styles. December 1st, you got it. That was Dragon Quest Monsters, the Dark Prince from Square Enix. Mm -hmm. The elf character looks kind of very similar. You take to become the master I can't put my finger on it, but he looks familiar to someone, doesn't he? Please be on the lookout for more info in the future. Cut. Next, we have more news on a certain game with plant-like creatures. Oh, please, don't fake me out this time, don't fake me out this time! Yes, Pikmin 4! What is it? What do you show me? What? Welcome to the Rescue Corps. Uh huh. As its newest recruit, you'll venture to a mysterious oh, planet. The, the aristocrat, the Mamuda! The fish. Oh, then what is that? -like We're gonna go inside a house? It's like a weird elephant looking thing. And the adorable rescue pup, Ochi. Ochi, okay, so that's his name. Your mission, should you choose to accept it. Repair yeah. the damaged Rescue Corps spaceship and save any castaways you find. Absolutely. Right, let's explore <laughs> together. Oh, so I'm guessing the dog sniffs out a path for you to follow. Plucked. Pikmin are ready for action. A health meter? Blow your whistle to gather so the dog has a health meter? You. Oh dear, Run that, that actually is kind of scary. That means the dog can die. For you. And there's that's the time Ochi meter. Will also prove to be a great canine companion. Right. He can carry items with Pikmin. Yeah. Oh. Or smash obstacles in your way. So I'm guessing he could be upgraded and to carry more. Device? Well. <laughs> there you go. He can swim without having Ochi Pikmin drown. Stand up to the wildest creatures. Oh. He'll fight for you. Oh. Collect lots oh, that of looked painful. Treasures. <laughs> A game the boy. To fix the spaceship's radar and open up new areas to explore. <gasps> Armored cannon beetle! Isn't limited to the oh my gosh! Circuit, Why not take the plunge underground? Oh, this is gonna be Here, good. A completely different environment <laughs> awaits. Oh, fans! Unusual contraptions. Oh, Native this is. Creatures. Oh, that's a, that's a big wally wog. And even more treasures are around. Oh, good. We don't have to carry the grapes like in Pikmin you Three. Might unexpectedly, find some castaways too. You don't even get to see their face, though. Huh. Well, at least they're alive. Hey, oh. wait a minute! What the heck? This leafy individual just nabbed the castaway. You've got to stop him. What the heck? It's time for a Dandori battle. <laughs> Dandori. Embrace the art of Dandori by strategically issuing commands to your Pikmin and Ochi. What? Collect more objects. We can than battle your within the time limit to win and save the castaway. Oh, that is interesting. By rescuing that, castaways. Why does that? Why did that stand Dory look like Olimar though? Which is right next to your spaceship. Train Ochi and oh. teach him new skills. Oh. You can. So or you have upgrade systems. And items to help make exploration more manageable. Oh yes, so we do have upgrades with the, the sparkle thing, and it's more than just. You can eventually set out for night expeditions. But there's a catch. What's the catch? Nightfall sends creatures into a frenzy, so stay alert. Yeah, it makes them <laughs> red-eyed and evil. You'll come oh. across the <gasps> new glow Pikmin. What? Only appear at night. Oh my gosh, he's a dog, a green Pikmin. That produce valuable glow sap. But he glows. Mounds also attract various wildlife. Uh oh. So use glow Pikmin to drive them away and protect the. Luminals. Oh, that. Oh, that. What the heck? What was that? What kind of attack was that?
I gotta see that again! Pikmin to drive them away and protect the Luminals. Luminals. He like flash grenade him. Grenaded him. Oh my gosh, that's amazing! Many so we do get another Pikmin! This uncharted planet. Oh but my gosh! And Ochi by your side. <laughs> no challenge is too big <laughs> or too small. Oh but Rock Pikmin! Pikmin and I also thought purple Pikmin too. We get to go inside of how? In past Pikmin games, you had to return to your spaceship before sundown. Right. However, in this latest entry, you can now venture out at night. <laughs> we get glow Pikmin. Pikmin on your expedition. <laughs> we have even more Pikmin news to share. Even more? HD versions oh! of the first two Pikmin games originally released on Nintendo GameCube. They're gonna be on the Switch. Nintendo eShop later today. <laughs> later, later today. Plus, ahead of the game's release, a demo of Pikmin 4 will be available on Nintendo eShop on June 28. Oh, the demo a demo of enjoyed, Pikmin 4. You've never played a game in the Pikmin series before, so we hope you'll try it out when it releases. I am absolutely gonna try it out. I'll probably record myself playing it because I want to see it. Or maybe I'll have to hold off, but I don't know. The renowned series of stealth oh. action games is infiltrating oh, Nintendo oh, Metal Switch Gear. As Metal Gear Solid Master Collection Volume One. Well, snakes me to come back. Includes Metal Gear Solid. Infiltrate and regain control of Shadow Moses Island. I can't believe that we, we get glowing Metal Pikmin and ice two, Pikmin and Sons of Liberty. Locate and retrieve a deadly amphibious weapon. Metal Gear Solid. I didn't three, think about that at all. Eater. Survive the jungle and I'm, I'm going to be about mentor. this for the whole time. You can also enjoy the games that started the series, Metal <laughs> Gear and Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake, as well as the NES versions of both Metal Gear and Snake's Revenge. <laughs> this compilation also contains the first Metal Gear Solid digital yeah. graphic novel and a digital sequel. graphic novel. Additional content includes screenplay Ooh. books and master books with story and character info, Ooh. strategy guides for each game, really? and a digital soundtrack. That's actually a nice touch. Metal Gear Solid Master Collection Volume 1 launches on Nintendo Switch October 24th. A lot of Pre amazing October releases. On Nintendo eShop. The first three Metal Gear Solid games will also be available separately on Nintendo eShop. All right, a lot of good things. It's time to survive. Is this can steal thyself? Oh, Vampire Survivors is coming to Nintendo Switch. Vampire Survivors, you eh? Have what it takes to survive a 30-minute onslaught of monsters. You know, this looks a lot like a mobile Stay game that I don't like. To avoid enemies. But honestly, this is way better. Automatically with your weapons. Seems easy at first, right? But swarms of increasingly stronger monsters will yeah. appear the longer you survive. <laughs> by getting treasure chests from defeated enemies, or yeah. by leveling up, you'll acquire weapons and upgrades for your character. So nice! Whoa! Fit. Plus, up to four players can now play together in couch co-op. Oh, that sounds like fun. What other horrors lie in <laughs> store? Find out when Vampire Survivors Holy launches crap. on the Nintendo Switch system, August 17th. All right. Music and pigeons? Sounds pretty oh. cool. I still want to see more Mario pigeon. stuff. Yeah, you heard that right. Pigeons? <laughs> what? Play online in this Rhythm Battle Royale and aim to be the Rhythm Battle Royale? Standing. Up to 30 players can ruffle each other's feathers <laughs> in musical minigames. <laughs> what? Oh, no. Copy the leader's actions perfectly in Yes, Commander. <laughs> fire a slingshot to play music Oh, it look, this looks like another shooter. Fall Guys game. But who knows? Maybe it could do better. In, to the sky and more. With over 20 minigames, you're in for an impeccably good time. The puns, come on. Ready to shake those pigeon tails when Headbangers <laughs> Rhythm Royale bops its way onto Nintendo Switch October 31st. Oh, I I have a feeling Mario may come into contact with that. Ready, set, you know which Mario. Yo! 
And what is this? Penny is on the run, entangled in a chaotic audition that veered way off script. She's managed <laughs> to make some powerful enemies and a oh, newly no. animated friend. In this 3D platforming adventure from the team behind Sonic Mania, yeah. you'll explore oh, Sonic Mania. the colorful world of Macaroon and help Penny and Yo-Yo escape the clutches <laughs> Penny of the and Yo -Yo. Emperor Eddie. Perform stylish acrobatic tricks to All avoid right. Eddie's massive horde of pushy penguins. <laughs> and power up Yo-Yo to protect Penny from foul play. You can also put Come your speedrunning skills to the test in time attack mode to <laughs> unlock special items, complete secret That's stages, really cool, and actually, more. looking. This is your big break. Very After reminiscent all, of, like, Hat in Time, Billy Bust Penny's Up. This looks breakaway. cool. Launches on Nintendo Switch early next year. All right, so early next year. Oh, Mario Kart's getting five. some new stuff. I, I like it. More Mario stuff. <laughs> <of the> Mario <laughs> so now we're just hanging out in his bathroom. <laughs> yeah, so we just get to be in his bathroom. Oh, Petey Piranha! Oh my gosh, for Double Dash! Oh, Wiggler! I love both of these characters so much! Oh! oh. And Kamek! Comic. So it's not so it's comic, not comic. Wave five of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC for the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game zooms onto Nintendo Switch this summer. I'll have to get it just for those, Active maybe. Nintendo Switch Online Plus expansion but I don't know. members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Oh. Two worlds, one fateful encounter. Okay. A remake of the second Star Ocean game, complete mm. with new graphics that fuse 2D and 3D. Oh, now way. that is a cool After a mission goes pixel wrong, style. Federation officer Claude is stranded on an undeveloped planet. Mm. There, he meets Reyna, who possesses mystical powers. Was it fate or mere coincidence? Soon after, the two get entangled in a sinister plot within the mm. galaxy. In this science fantasy RPG, select either Claude or Reyna as your hero and play through the story from their perspective. Okay. You'll also meet over a dozen potential allies hmm. from all walks of life. During your adventure, the hero you chose and the decisions you make will have an impact on who can be recruited to your cause. I see. Battles take place in real time and skills can oh. be performed with a single button. That's actually really cool. I'm saying that about a lot of things. This is a really good, uh, really good direct. It looked like he had Kirby's like mech for a moment. Party unleash follow-up attacks, letting you map out strategic battles in your favor. <laughs> As you search for a way home, an ancient prophecy will unfold, and your destiny will be awakened. All right. Save the planet in Star Ocean: The Second Story R, launching on Nintendo Switch November second. All right. It's time to move it. Oh my gosh, the new WarioWare! Get ready for oh yeah! In the latest Wario, he's the one who wins! <laughs> Hold two Joy-Con controllers, then action! <laughs> move your body to take on a flurry All right. of fast micro games. What you do and how you move depends on the micro game. <laughs> React quickly with the right movement oh, and you'll is... be on the road oh, to Murray. victory. Excellent. If you've got two pairs That's of controllers, so cool. play with a friend in local co-op. Sync up your actions to beat each. Oh, player. you can do two player. Plus, up to four players can live it up across <laughs> various mini games in party mode. For example, this dicey board game the, is going to keep you on We got a WarioWare style Mario party. Brilliant! Get your body moving in over 200 lightning fast oh, micro Pikmin. games. <laughs> Wario, Wario the train. Move it. Launching <laughs> on the Nintendo Switch system November 3rd. Pre got it. You got today it. On Nintendo eShop. Dude, dude, come on, be a professional. Why aren't you saying anything? Because you're being weird. He was so into it. I didn't want to interrupt. Anyway, this is the latest WarioWare game. 
So we get to see all the other characters too, like all like five volt, nine volt, eighteen volt. We get to see Mona. We get to see Jimmy, maybe Cat and Anna. Families can join the fun at Nintendo Live 2023. What's Nintendo Live? Enjoy live performances. Take photos with some of your favorite characters. Hey Mario and more. Goombas. Cheer on your favorite players in two championships. Eligible Ooh. attendees can also compete in on-site tournaments and participate in a last chance qualifier. Nice. This all-ages celebration is free and will take place September 1st through 4th in Seattle, Washington. Registration for Nintendo Live 2023 ends June 22nd. Okay. Head over to the official website and enter the random drawing for a chance to receive tickets. I wonder who's going to participate in that. I don't even have close to the skills the needed PAX to the chance of this world. Details. Those not selected will have another chance to attend with the three Challenge Cups oh. this summer. The top ten players from each will get tickets. Please visit the official website for more details. I See will have there. to. A vast number of players are enjoying their time in high Yes, yes we are. You did a great job with this game. Which released last I will ask one thing. Change the time limit on the wings and balloons, please. That's all. An amiibo figure of Link from the game was released to coincide with the game's launch. Ah, nice design. New amiibo of Zelda and Ganondorf are planned to be released this holiday. We hope you're looking forward so to it. So we get Link before Zelda and Ganon. Okay, this next segment will be our last announcement. Right. Please take a look. What are you going to finish this off with? Oh. Onward and upward. <laughs> what? A new Mario game? Oh, this looks strange, but I like it. <laughs> oh, these are some weird characters. So we get a new Mario game at last. <laughs> What's with the talking flowers? <laughs> What's the flower about, though? Huh? A new power up? What does it do? Uh... Oh, it just makes the world go crazy. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Oh, what the heck? Oh, it turns everything alive. That's what it does. Oh, that is... What the heck? What the heck? Is Mario, like, shape-shifting in the different things? A wonder seed. Mario Bros. Wonder. Is this like a dream world? <laughs> what the? <laughs> oh, you get to play as Daisy! Hey! Oh, what? Wiggler? Oh, this is... I don't know what to say. This is already really cool looking. <laughs> I can't tell half of what's going on. Is this just a this is like an acid trip of a Mario game? And I don't know if I hate it or love it. I think I love it. A wonder seed. Who is that? Who is that little caterpillar guy? October 20th. Okay. Huh? What? And... What? What the hell?! Did it turn into a freaking elephant?! What the heck?! <laughs> that was the brand new 2D side-scrolling Mario game. Super Why did you turn Mario into an elephant?! When you touch a wonder flower, yeah? expect the unexpected. The ground could start moving, or you might turn into something different, for example. Yeah. There were also flowers talking. Yeah. Daisy is playable. Yeah. And Mario became an elephant at the end. Yes, why? Things happened. We'll share more details in the future, so we hope you'll look forward to it.
Okay. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. Oh my lord! That was amazing! That was so worth the wait today! Oh my god, where do I begin with how well some of that stuff- First thing, we got brand new Mario games at long last! We didn't get Mario Odyssey 2, but... We got some really interesting stuff, though! <laughs> I mean, we're getting a remake of Mario RPG, which is going to be great. Because I've always wanted to play Mario RPG, but just don't have the hardware to do it. So, we're getting a lot more in Pikmin 4 than I can discuss. So, we do get another Pikmin type. We get glowing Pikmin. Green, glowy Pikmin. That is really interesting. I, That was not something I thought about. I thought about all manner of Pikmin types. And I've seen all kinds of videos about people talking about different Pikmin types. And still, we all got it pretty wrong. I don't, I don't remember anyone who talked about glowing Pikmin. If there is someone, let me know because, buddy, congratulations, you guessed right. <laughs> oh my word, there, there was a lot to take it. So, you know, a lot of good indie games that were coming out too. You know, a lot of really well-designed, pixelated RPG games which look very nice. Uh, like Star Ocean actually looked pretty nice, which. Was really good. I'm glad that we're getting a new Princess Peach game, apparently, and we're getting... A, sorry if I move the screen. We're getting Ladies Mansion Dark Moon on the Switch, which I'm happy about, because now I can get it back again, and honestly, I, Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon was one of my favorite Luigi's Mansion games, gameplay-wise. It's the funnest to play for me. Not, like, the first one is definitely the scariest. The third one mm, is... Honestly, I think kind of the weaker one, but number two was definitely my favorite to play, and so I cannot wait to play that game again. But biggest thing, biggest thing out of all of those, the DLC for Mario Plus Rabbit The Sparks of Hope comes out today! The last Spark Hunter DLC comes out today, and I can't believe that! Oh my god, you will bet I am going to be recording that as soon as I can. I am also going to be trying to record the Tower of Doom as well, so expect, you know what, a double upload of Mario Plus Rabbit Sparks of Hope, likely sometime tomorrow, because again, I have to record a bunch of other videos today, and I just don't have the time to record them all. I wish I did, but I don't, I'm sorry. I know, there's a lot of work to do since I've been back, and I want to get back and hard work hard at video for videos for you guys. So, I've recorded this one. I'm going to be recording the SG4 reaction. And then I'm going to start recording um, the Let's Plays of The Last Spark Hunter and The Tower of Doom. No, but we're not done yet. There's actually one last thing I want to talk about. So, we get a new main Mario game, Mario Brothers Wonder. And honestly, it was one heck of an acid trip for a Mario game. The weirdest stuff happened. Like, a pipe came to life and started crawling like an inchworm. They, like, we get Daisy to... To play alongside everybody, and that's good. We have foreground and background effects. We have like diff all kinds of different enemies now. And weirdest of all, Mario turned into a freaking elephant. What? So, they get the elephant power up now. <laughs> so now I want to know what that does. So makes him big, makes him strong. He hit the Goomba with his trunk. We have talking flowers. So, I'm wondering what that's about. We also get the uh, Scarlet and Violet DLC, and we get to see a bunch of Johto Pokemon, which is really fun. Uh, yeah, we did get a lot of Johto Pokemon in Scarlet and Violet. Like, Wooper's one of the bigger ones, but we get to see even more of them from what I saw. So, I'm excited to see where all of these go. This was a great direct. I cannot stop smiling right now. There's so much I've got to work on and got to look forward to. Oh, this year is a great year for games, I've got to say. Especially for this channel, especially for me, and especially, of all, for you guys. Because you get to see me do all that, and I hope you guys will like it. So, I hope you guys like this reaction. I loved this. Be sure to like and subscribe if you want to check out my other videos. I do Let's Plays and reactions. I would mainly react to SMG4, but I'm willing to react to all manner of different things. Uh, I also play Mario Plus Rabbit Sparks of Hope, and I'm thinking of getting back into Splatoon 3 again now that the new Splatfest is coming up. I know I haven't played Splatfest in a while, it's just because I didn't think they were as popular as my other videos, so I'm going to get back into it again and try it again. I played the main story, and now I'm going to... Uh, I think get back into it at some point. That being said, I hope you guys liked this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! <laughs> Sorry. Bye.